The Hollywood Walk of Fame's class of 2024 has been revealed. Access Hollywood's Mario Lopez, Gwen Stefani, Chris Pine, Shirley Ralph, Michelle Yeoh, and Gal Gadot are some of the celebrities who were selected by the Walk of Fame selection panel to receive a star. Chadwick Boseman was also chosen to receive a posthumous star on the Walk of Fame. Following the announcement, Mario showed off his excitement over the news on his Instagram, sharing a video of him watching the nomination ceremony on Monday. We move on to our next category, and that is television. The incomparable Eugene Levy. Sports commentator Jim Nance. The doctor is in, Ken Jeong. Award-winning actress, producer, and director, Kerry Washington. Television's golden boy, Mario Lopez. Comedy TV series creator, writer, and producer. Woo! <laughs> double star ceremony good. for Chula Vista. <laughs> Congratulations, <laughs> baby. Not bad for a Mexican kid from Chula Vista. Incredibly honored. Thank you, Walk of Fame. He captioned the video. Being chosen by the committee does not mean the nominees will automatically get a star. They have two years to select a date for their ceremony. Nonetheless, being selected is a huge honor. Here are the other stars who were selected to get a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Of the Board of Directors of the Chamber of Commerce and the chair of our board, Matt Fritch, who is with us uh, today. We are thrilled to be here as we announce this year's 2024 Hollywood Walk of Fame class. Now, before we start, I uh, wish to thank our sponsors, Variety and Niagara Bottling, for their support both of the Hollywood Chamber and of the Hollywood Walk of Fame. It is, as you can see, a stunningly beautiful morning, and we are live from a spectacular setting, the Astor Hollywood. The Astor Hollywood is a purpose-driven social club inspired by the passion of the music, arts, and entertainment communities that built this neighborhood and that continue to fuel the innovation and creativity shared around the globe from this place we all know as Hollywood. Over my left shoulder, up on the hills of Hollywood behind me, is the historic Hollywood sign, which will celebrate its 100th anniversary in December of this year. It's looking pretty good for 99 and a half right now. For the past century, the Hollywood sign has stood tall as a testament to the spirit of Hollywood. And we're excited to celebrate the centennial of this iconic, iconic landmark. The Hollywood sign has also looked over 100 years of legends of Hollywood and the Walk of Fame, while the sign is up there in the hills, the Walk of Fame down on the streets of Hollywood celebrates and commemorates those legends, welcoming millions of visitors from around the world. To announce this year's legends, I'd like to introduce a Walk of Famer in her own right. Ellen Kay of iHeartRadio, Chair of the Walk of Fame Selection Committee. Ellen, take it away. Thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you so much, Steve. I'm also a proud resident of Hollywood and so happy to be here. Uh, so I'm excited to announce our honorees for the class of 2024. Let's get started. We're going to start with motion pictures. Beloved actor, Chadwick Boseman. Award-winning actor and philanthropist, Chris Pine. Animation innovator, Chris Melandrandri. Fan favorite, Christina Ricci. Actress and Wonder Woman, Gal Gadot. The marvelous, Kevin Feige. Actress, producer, and screenwriter, Maggie Gyllenhaal and this year's Oscar winner for Best Actress, Michelle Yeoh. Let's hear it for the recording category. We've all grown up with this actress and singer, Brandi Norwood, historic songwriter and composer, Charles Fox, one of country music's best, Darius Rucker. Rock fans are gonna love this, Def Leppard. Legendary hip hop artist, Dr. Dre, Award-winning songwriter, Glenn Ballad. Just a girl, getting a star on the Walk of Fame, Gwen Stefani. Rock legend, Sammy Hagar. 
and queen of R&B, Toni Braxton. They all make me a little emotional because <laughs> they're all friends. Congrats. And for the live theater, live performance honorees, the late iconic singer, Otis Redding, and comic genius, Jane Krakowski. In the category of sports entertainment, tennis phenomenon and sports broadcaster, Billie Jean King, and former NFL player and actor, Carl Weathers. In the category of radio, my good friend and Radio Hall of Famer, Angie Martinez. We move on to our next category, and that is television. The incomparable Eugene Levy. Sports commentator, Jim Nance. The doctor is in, Ken Jeong. Award-winning actress, producer, and director, Carrie Washington. Television's golden boy, Mario Lopez. Comedy TV series creator, writer, and producer, Michael Schur. Triple threat, Cheryl Lee Ralph. And a double star ceremony for television hosts, Raul de Molina and Lily Estefan. We are so thrilled for the class of 2024. Thank you to everyone who tuned in. Congratulations to all of our Walk of Famers, an amazing class. And thank you so much to all of you for tuning in and to our selection committee. The path I've taken from the streets of the Bronx to this moment on Hollywood Boulevard, and this all feels, I don't know, kind of surreal. I just wanted to be good at what I did. I wanted to be a great actress. I wanted to be a great singer. I wanted to be a great performer to share the joy of entertaining you. This is Hollywood with the mecca of entertainment around the world. It all starts right here. This is what it all comes down to. It all comes down to your family and working hard to love and protect and do everything that you can to make your family and the ones you love their lives better. It's thrilling to have Anna Mae Wong, the first Asian American actress as my neighbor. We could actually start our own little Chinatown right here. <laughs> I think about what a star is, and I think about a star being liked for so many people. A star you can always see, even in darkness. So my hope is that anyone in this town whose dreams may be on life support, I want you to walk past this star in particular and know that I've been there. This one in particular is for the underdogs. an incredible day. I'm trying to soak it all in. Here's the thing about these Hollywood stars. They're permanent. What is a legacy? It's planting seeds in a garden you never get to see. Well, we get to see this star every day on the corner of Hollywood and Argyle. Lo único que les puedo decir es que siempre recuerden que trabajando mucho, sin descansar y respetándose uno mismo y respetando a los demás, se pueden lograr cosas que uno nunca se soñó. Gracias a todos mis fans por estar aquí y un beso a Colombia y a todos los colombianos que están aquí. Gracias por venir. I feel like a lot of people probably only ever thought I'd make it to the Walk of Shame, but here I am. Today for me is a celebration of something that my dad taught me and that is to thine own self be true.